This is a light source that we haven't shown in my videos much, mainly because I particularly dislike seeing them in new installations outdoors because the color is kind of irritating to the eyes. High pressure sodium. Don't get me wrong, they're fun to play with though. One drawback of these is the how uh, noticeably low contrast they are. I mean, all my facial features are sort of blending together. So, uh, if you have to sort of see something or identify someone from down the block, it's kind of difficult. Plus, I've noticed that visibility driving under these is pretty bad. It's been much better with the uh, mercury vapor bulbs and metal halide, which is another thing. The reason I'm not showing a startup this time is because they actually take much longer to start up to fully warm up than a mercury vapor bulb. But here is one thing that I can show you now that it's warmed up all the way. A hot restrike. You see it's kind of glowing dimly. Now we're going to plug it back in. Should see a cool... Yep, and there it is. Little lightning lightning bolt effect inside the arc tube. It's, it's actually strobing, though it's hard to see this with the camera. Pretty awesome. This is the high pressure sodium hot restrike. Now this is pretty cool. Almost like a candle. And it's back on again. When you try to do a hot restrike with a mercury vapor bulb, it just stays dim for a little bit until it goes back on. You don't get the lightning bolt effect. However, the mercury vapor color is more pleasant, so it's a trade off. High pressure sodium, hot restrike. Latest.